Good morning riders and welcome back to another video on Adventure Bike Riders. Today we shall be visiting Quick Fit to fit some new shoes on my Triumph Tiger Rally Pro. So I've decided to go for the Metzler's Carufo, 4, so stay switched on for a small review on these tyres. So hello everybody and thank you for clicking on this video. For those of you who are new, my name is Jamie. I usually do videos on motor vlogging and the occasional reviews. Today we shall be reviewing these new tires I've just fitted, the Metzler Karu 4. And I shall be trying them in different terrains. I shall be trying them off-road as well as on motorways. So I just fitted the Metzler Karu 4 on my Triumph Tiger Rally Pro Aragon Edition and I've tested it for a few kilometers on road, some twisty bends and they seem to do the job absolutely fine on tarmac so hopefully tomorrow or during the course of the weekend I will try to go over to Spain over there because I'm currently in Gibraltar and I'll see if I can get into a few dead tracks to try them out off-road but as I said I've done a few kilometers on tarmac with some twisty bends and they do feel pretty good not much vibration slightly heavier on turns obviously compared to road tires and the noise is not that bad I thought it was gonna be much worse than what I have experienced. There's a bit of noise, obviously, as you got these treads, but not that bad. I thought it was going to be much worse. So just uh, keep locked on to the video, and hopefully, tomorrow I shall be going over to Spain to see how they act on some gravel roads, on dead roads. So as I said previously, I've come over to Algeciras, Spain and I've come to this trail, I already know it's a trail that connects from Algeciras to Tarifa it's part of the Trans-European Trail and I'll be trying these tyres off-road for what I can see for the first kilometres they do respond very well on off-road compared to other tyres I've had previously I've tried the Pirelli STR Scorpions which were fantastic tyres on tarmac they lacked slightly on off-road and also I've tried the Anarchy Wild the Anarchy Wild were very good off-road but they lacked a lot on tarmac they were not that great on tarmac must say so just stay switched on and see what these tyres are capable of. Damn, I love these tires. Woohoo! They perform absolutely incredible off-road. Barely highly recommended. Obviously, 
you must remember we are not enduro bikes so we cannot go extreme nobbies but for adventure bike adventure bike sorry and tarmac they do go pretty well very highly recommended tires So you have to take in consideration that these tires are rated Q, which means you, can, you have a maximum speed of 99 miles per hour or 160 kilometers per hour. It's not safe to go above those limits, but there and then you do not need to go more than 160 as the usual speed limit around Spain is 120 kilometers per hour. So that should be more than enough for me. As you can see now, I'm on the motorway. I'm doing 90 kilometers an hour. I'll bring all the way up to 120 to demonstrate to you guys there's no weird vibrations coming from these tires at all. As you can see on the handlebars. Unfortunately, I've had to cancel out the audio from the GoPro as it was far too windy. I'm just waiting for some dead cats to arrive to fit onto the GoPro. And these tires are absolutely amazing. So far so good. They handle superb off-road, they handle superb on-road. It's very difficult to find a perfect tire for both situations. But I think these tires do perform very well 50-50. So if you're thinking about Metzler's Caru 4, I highly suggest you go for them. Well riders, that's all from me today. I hope you found this video helpful. If you have, please remember to give it a thumbs up and please remember to subscribe. I'll see you in my next video. Thank you very much for watching.